today we will discuss about units. Unit is a very important aspect in measurement. So, so we will discuss about unit in detail. What is unit? Actually, unit is the standard with which things are compared. Things are compared. It's called unit. The standard with, with which things are compared is called as unit. For example, we have mass. So, we use standard for mass which is kilogram. So, kilogram is the unit for mass. We have length. So, we use meter for that. So, length meter is the standard for length. We have meter per second. Meters per second is the standard for speed or velocity. So, we have these things as standard. These are units. There are two types of units. One is base units and another is derived units. Base unit, the unit of base physical quantities. Units of base physical quantities are called base units. As we have seven base physical quantities, so the units of those base physical quantities are called base unit. We have mass, so the unit of mass is kilogram. We have length, so the unit of length is meter. We have time, so the unit of time is second. We have temperature, so the unit of temperature is Kelvin. We have current, so the unit of current is ampere. We have intensity of light, so the unit of intensity of light is candela. And we have amount of substance, so the unit of amount of substance is mole. This is called base unit. Let's come to derived units. Derived units are the units derived from base units. Units obtained from base units. Units obtained from base units, for example, speed. So the unit of speed is meter per second. So this unit is obtained from base units. So this is called the right unit. We have acceleration. So the unit of acceleration is meter per second square. So this is derived from base units. This is called as derived unit. We have force. The unit of force is kg meter per second square, which is derived from base units.